Whatever happened to ending games on a high note? With this list, we honor the video game men and women that didn't make it before the credits rolled. Get ready for the top five games where you die at the end. And spoiler alert, of course. Your touch, a spark, a spark to save the world. Wait, do not touch the pedestal. Minerva? The death of Desmond Miles was a big shock to us. His story ended with him sacrificing himself to save the world. Sure, it was a hero's death, but that didn't make it any easier to deal with. In Shadow of the Colossus, you pay the ultimate price for killing 16 innocent giants in order to bring a lost love back to life. Ironically, in the final battle, you are turned into a colossus yourself and killed by humans. You're cold. It's not all bad since the girl does come back to life and you are reborn as a horned baby. There's only one thing you can do. You know that. I don't know if I can. Many gamers were touched by the death of Lee Everett in the first season of The Walking Dead. The protagonist had done his very best to protect Clementine. Now it was the same little girl that had to make the impossible choice of letting him turn into a zombie or killing him on the spot. What a sad ending to such a great game. The last mission in Halo Reach has a very simple objective, survive. However, it doesn't take long before you start to realize that's impossible. All you can do is fight off as many enemies as you can before you inevitably die. This sacrifice wasn't in vain as it led to the discovery of Halo and ultimately the demise of the entire Covenant. And because of you, we found Halo, unlocked its secrets, shattered our enemy's resolve. Our victory, your victory, was so close. I wish you could have lived to see it. I won't let you down, Narika. I'll keep the sword safe. Maybe even forgotten, but I'll always remember you. Can you hear them? They're calling to us. It's beautiful. Forgive me, sir. It was an honor. He's Zachary Tomstock. He's Booker DeWitt. I love you. I love you. Now go! Get! We absolutely loved playing the tough cowboy John Marston in Red Dead Redemption. So imagine our surprise when he suddenly gets shot to bits at the end of the game. In a brilliant move by Rockstar, the game continues after the death of the main character. As his son, you get a chance to settle the score and avenge your father's death, which is just awesome.